The Department of Justice wants major changes at Google after a federal judge ruled that the online giant is a search engine monopoly. As part of its proposed penalties, the DOJ wants Google to sell its Chrome web browser. In a court filing, prosecutors writing, the playing field is not level because of Google's conduct, and Google's quality reflects the ill-gotten gains of an advantage illegally acquired. NYU law professor Eleanor Fox says Judge Amit Mita must consider how the competition was stifled. So when it comes time for the remedy, you want a remedy that will restore the competition that was lost through the illegal acts. And the Department of Justice proposes that um, Google must be required to divest itself of Chrome. Google calls the proposed punishment, quote, staggering and says it would make it harder for people to use the search engine that they like. Its chief legal officer writing in part, the proposals are, quote, unprecedented government overreach that would jeopardize America's global economic and technological leadership. The DOJ also wants Google to stop pushing its own products to the top of search results. Professor Fox says consumers would benefit from more competition. So Google has a bias. And consumers would really like to not have to go through a biased engine. Uh, we'd like to get the real results rather than the biased results. Average Way Burnett, Scripps News, Washington.